Welcome to the Theby Waxing Show. I'm putting in the caption. We are talking about the green tea cleanser today. Let me pin it real quick. Hey, Miss KK. How are you, Miss KK27? Welcome to the Theby Waxing Show. So this is the cleanser we're talking about today. Hey, the Honey Pot Aesthetics. Welcome back to the 3B Waxing Show. How are you? How are you? How are you? Okay. So, <clears throat> welcome to the 3B Waxing Show. Today is, I pinned the topic, the Gentle Tea Citrus Cleanser. She said, hey y'all, hey y'all, hi. Um, welcome, the Vesti Moni. Hopefully I said that right. Yes, D. Moni, welcome to the 3B Waxing Show. Welcome, welcome. All right. So let's get through the announcements and then we're gonna get into this cleanser. I wanna highlight one of the ingredients and what I've decided to do, I thought about this over the weekend. Hey, Sar. Uh, hey, welcome to the B Waxing Show, Demika, for D or B, sorry. Welcome to the B Waxing Show. So over the weekend, I decided that um, we're still, for Tuesdays, I still want to highlight products and highlight uh, ingredients, but I'm going to focus on one ingredient every show so I can really go in depth about those ingredients because I felt like in the past uh, shows, I put give you guys a lot of ingredients at one time and it can be a little bit much, so um, I'm just breaking it down. And so... At first, I was thinking of just doing the cleanser for like a whole month and then doing each ingredient, but I'll switch it up. That way, in case you're working on cleanser, or in case you're working on serum, every week it's not the same. So, um, yeah. So, let me get into announcements. First announcement is uh, I'm still doing skin improvement calls. I actually am doing calls today. Tuesdays are my day to do calls. You can book it if you click the link in the bio and do book appointment. Right now, it's set as Pacific Standard Time. A lot of people are out of the states that have been booking. Uh, we've just been playing it and figuring it out as we go. Um, so whether you're Eastern Standard Time or Central Standard Time, I'll usually email you and be like, hey, um, can we make sure this time works? Like I have a few emails that I need to go into right now and... Um, make sure the times are right but yeah it is Pacific Standard Time and then I will contact you to see what part of the um what part of the country you are at so skin improvement calls those are the calls that you can book if you are wanting me to teach you how to wax or if you want me to teach your partner how to wax um I did that post recently it is possible for your partner to learn how to wax you and get you what get your Brazilian wax done in 30 minutes. Hey uh TT26, welcome to the 3B Waxing Show. So that's an option. Um I have done I have done it before with a client where uh her boyfriend had never waxed before and I taught him and we were able to do it in a 30 minute period. So you can do it on your lunch break. It's very, very possible. Hi. So, um, yeah, that's the first thing. The other thing about skin improvement calls is that um, you can book it if you are figuring out either what ingredients are in your products that are helping you or hurting you or if you're trying to figure out your skin routine. It, this is a good time, especially if you're at home, working from home, and you have a little more time because you're not commuting to start uh, working on your skin routine and just, you know, 
one thing I've mentioned early when we first started the quarantine was take a bunch of your products out and start seeing what do I use, what do I don't use, what um, is old, what's not helping me. Look at expiration dates on there. Uh, hey, you're so cute. Uh, welcome to the 3B Waxing Show. So start looking at that and then start cleaning the bottles because sometimes our bottles get really disgusting and so start cleaning your bottles uh, and then uh, you can use the perfect skincare guide that I give you guys to you know map out a skin routine or you can do that skin improvement call and we can work together so that's the other thing and the one thing I wanted to say with that announcement is that you will get if you book it at full price this month you will get free shipping uh, on 3 Hey, sexy since 1983. Welcome to the 3B Waxing Show. The second announcement I have for today is that the Acme Ingrown Pads and the Fruit Enzyme Pads are out of stock. I have one more package that I need to get out um, from that whole shipment that I was doing. So, hey beautiful, um, disaster, welcome to the 3B Waxing Show, welcome, I am Keisha, welcome to the 3B Waxing Show. So, I have one more package left, I may do that today before I, um, have my calls today. If you are wanting to get on the wait list for those pads, click the link in the bio and it's the fourth button. I was not expecting the pads to go out of stock that fast um I was planning I was thinking that I would be back in stock with the pads later but I think it's going to be sooner with some things going on so uh click the link in the bio it's the fourth button you'll know when we're back in stock hey mahogany welcome to the 3 waxing show all right so let's get into it I'll introduce myself and then we'll get into this cleanser Welcome to the 3 Waxing Show. Welcome to the 3 Waxing Show. And so you remember, welcome to the 3 Waxing Show. I am Becca, your pro waxer and skin therapist since 2010. I help people remove unwanted hair, acne, discoloration, and ingrowns through full body waxing, chemical peels, facials, and my products. I have my own product line, which is my exfoliating pads. There's two jars, the acne and ingrown pads and the fruit enzyme pads. They have been sold all over the U.S., the U.K., Canada, and the U.A.E., they are chemical exfoliants, so they're good for sensitive skin. They're good for dark spots, ingrowns. Um, the fruit enzyme pads are organic fruit enzymes that eat away at the dead skin cells. And then the acne and ingrown pads have salicylic, and lactic acid. Um, I also help estheticians start their own product line, start their own salon suite, attract clients, and improve their waxing technique. Because I've been the regional trainer for a large waxing franchise, which you've probably heard of, and the lead esthetician and pro waxer at a high-end gym in Newport Beach, California. I go live Tuesday through Friday. Tuesdays are about products and ingredients. And the reason why I started doing this is that way you are able to learn about products and ingredients as well. Because I only put quality products on the show. And, um you learn about ingredients. That way you are better informed when you are picking skincare products. So join the lab if you wanna know when I go live on Tuesdays. The I just emailed the lab right before I went on. So I email them right before I go on. And um, sometimes I break down what we talked about the week before. On Tuesdays, or sorry, on Wednesdays, I do esthetician education, so it's information, estheticians I've, I'm a licensed esthetician and um, lately we've been talking about starting your own product line you can join the salon tea if you want to do that if you want to know when I go live on Wednesdays and then Thursdays I do Q&A on anything I will I do open up Q&A at the end of every show but Thursdays I just do a full Q&A so if there aren't questions I'll I'll have like questions that people ask me constantly and then I'll talk about those on Fridays, I talk about waxing, and you can join the Wax Lounge to know uh, when I go live on Fridays. Hey, Janelle, 
0506, welcome to the Three Boxing Show. Hey, Fabulous Flawless, welcome to the Three Boxing Show. Hey, uh, Nina Parker, welcome to the Three Boxing Show. So that's the intro, that's who I am, that's what I do, um, and those are the ways to stay connected. So this is SkinScript. I've talked a lot about SkinScript. The reason why I keep it in the salon is I love their products. Uh, this is more of a natural uh, product line for those of you who are really looking towards organic products or natural products. Uh, I wouldn't say this; these aren't organic, but they are really natural. So the one we're highlighting today is a green tea citrus cleanser. And one thing about skin script is you can only get it through estheticians, which is a good way to help educate people on their skincare before they're buying it. So it looks like this is the 6.5 ounce bottle. And I'm just gonna pour it out so you kind of see. It's clear, it smells good. It has, the, the ingredient we're talking about today is grapefruit uh, peel oil, and it actually smells a lot like grapefruit. So that's what it looks like. It has on there the foaming cleanser, but I would say that it's more like a gel. Yeah, it does foam when you're doing it, on when you're cleansing your skin, but it's more of a gel cleanser. Hey, Reezy, welcome to the Three Blacksing Show. So that's what it looks like. Boom. So I'm going to get out the whiteboard. If you're new to the show, I love doing the whiteboard. Um, it's a good way to take notes. When I write, I have not learned how to write backwards. I don't even know if I plan on learning that. But uh, you can take a screenshot of it. And then in your camera roll, when you're editing it, you can flip it. So it'll read correctly. That's how in the videos that I post, it reads correctly. So some properties of this cleanser now. Well, I'll talk about it in a second. I'm just gonna write. I'm gonna write them all. Okay, so three big benefits of this cleanser. Hey, um, welcome to the Three Waxing Show. Uh, the misses, the misses. Welcome to the Three Waxing Show. Okay, so some good things about this cleanser is one, it's really gentle. Um, even though yes, it has lemon in it, lemon oil and grapefruit. And that can seem like it's really strong. It also has tea tree. It's gentle on the skin. This is really good if you have sensitive skin, if you get red really fast, um, if you have been drying out your skin with cleansers that are just too heavy and you need something to, a cleanser to put in your routine that's uh, more calming, this is a good one. It also is going to deep cleanse and calm. So the tea tree oil is good for calming, as well as even though it's gentle, it's deep cleansing. Uh, sometimes really gentle cleansers, especially, especially creamy cleansers, this isn't a creamy cleanser, but sometimes they get so, they're so gentle that you really don't feel like your skin is getting clean. And um, that's not the case with this one. Another aspect of it it's going to remove excess oils um i really th think that this is a great first time cleanser what do i mean by that welcome to the three waxing show sandy i believe that if you are cleansing your skin and you are getting good with your routine your face routine it is going to be beneficial to have multiple cleansers in your cabinet. I did a post about this over the weekend. You can check it out. It's a video. 
because I did last week I did uh my nightly routine and just kind of gave some pointers on improving your skin and the reason why you want multiple cleansers is because you really should be cleansing your skin twice every time you cleanse your skin so you do a first time cleanse that gets rid of the oils and then the second time the cleanser is going into the pores having multiple cleansers is good because you don't always need a gentle you don't always want a gentle cleanser you don't always want a very strong cleanser you can mix it up especially depending on what you're doing after you cleanse uh hey kaya welcome to the three watson show welcome back so the thing is this is really good as a first and second cleanser if you are planning on using a strong cleanser, say you have one that has, um, say you have the raspberry cleanser uh, from this line, and uh, that has salicylic acid. I think it has glycolic acid, so it's pretty strong. It's not one that you really want to use every single day, especially um, if you your skin's more towards the dehydrated. You wouldn't want to use that that strong of a cleanser all the time, and so. Doing your first cleanse with something a little more gentle and then your second cleanse with your your um, raspberry cleanser or whatever has salicylic and glycolic or benzoyl peroxide, whatever you, other cleanser you have, is going to be very beneficial because it's not going to dry out your skin. So hopefully that makes sense. Uh, this is a good first time cleanser or if you're really sensitive or have normal combination skin, you can use this for your first cleanser and your second cleanser. Uh, but very good for a first time cleanser. So I'm gonna put the benefits of this up. If you need to screenshot it and then flip it. And then we will go into great, the great pill, pill oil. Because this has a lot of ingredient, good ingredients. Uh, Skin Script has in general a lot of good ingredients that's why i carry it i know i already said that but their ingredients are top of the line i mean so is pca that's why i like them both but okay make sure you have that for those of you who just joined um since starting since i started the video welcome to the three boxing show welcome to the three boxing show and so you remember welcome to the three boxing show I am Becca, your pro waxer, skin therapist, and licensed esthetician since 2010. I help people remove unwanted hair, acne, discoloration, and ingrowns through full body waxing, chemical peels, uh, facials, and products. I have my own product line. That's my exfoliating pads that have been sold in the U.S., the U.K., Canada, and the U.A.E. Uh, they are out of stock right now, but I was saying earlier that you can get on the wait list. And you can do that by clicking the link link in the bio and then pressing the fourth button that'll get you on the wait list i think i'm gonna be in stock pretty soon honest to be honest with you uh yeah they've been sold in the us the uk canada and the uae i also help estheticians start their own product line start their own salon suite attract clients and improve their waxing technique because so i've been the regional trainer for a large waxing franchise which you've probably heard of and then um, the lead esthetician and pro waxer at a high-end gym in newport beach uh, to stay connected with me, if you want to know when I go live about products, join the lab. Uh, click the link in the bio. It's the lab. Uh, I I email the lab before I go live. If you want to know when I go live on Wednesdays to help estheticians, uh, join the salon tea. I'll give you the tea. I'm Renee Salon. And then uh, Fridays, if you want to know about waxing, join the wax lounge. And I uh, will email the wax lounge before... I go live on Fridays. And then there's other ways to stay connected to me. You can do a skin consultation call or if you're an esthetician, uh, do a pick membrane call. All right, so hopefully everyone got this information. Uh, hey, Nurse Jazz, welcome to the 3B Waxing Show. Hey, Shine by Mel, welcome to the 3B Waxing Show. Okay, so let's do a grapefruit peel. Now, I really wanted to, part of the show, I want to have visuals. I didn't, I wasn't able to get a visual for this one. Uh, she said, do you have a YouTube channel? Yes, I do. So if you go to, uh, my first name is Becca, B-E-K-A. 
And then the last name is Hassong, H-U-S-S-O-N-G. That's uh, the name under the channel. Most, not all, but most of my videos from the show go on to there. The times that they don't are usually because I turn them into digital products. So there's some videos or some shows that, you know, they become paid products, but um, most of the um, shows come, are on there. Hey, uh, Medusa, welcome to the 3B Waxing Show. Okay, so one thing I really want to do with the 3B Waxing Show is have more visuals. I wasn't able to get um, a grapefruit peel. Like, if you've been following me, we did the kiwi and I ate the kiwi on live. Um, I can never say this right, yucca, the yucca root. I found it at the grocery store and that's one of the ingredients in here. And when I talk about it, I'm gonna get actually get the root. Um, I don't actually have the grapefruit peel, but you know what grapefruit looks like. So I'm gonna put the grapefruit peel oil. And this is in the cleanser. Now, say you're not looking for a cleanser. Well, one, all the stuff I talk about with the grapefruit cleanser and you find this information beneficial, then this cleanser may be for you. Say you already have a cleanser that you love. Just having this information about the oil can um, help you for future purchases or when you see it in products, you know what it's doing and why it's in there. Also, this is for those of you who do make your own products. I'm not the biggest fan of people doing that just because um, you can burn your skin sometimes, but there are people who do it. And so this will also help you as well understand what ingredients uh, do what. So I'm going to write, write them and then I'll talk about them. First thing is that it's rich in vitamin C. So if you've been on the show, uh, welcome Penny, welcome back to the 3B Waxing Show. If you've been on the show or been to the show, you know that we talk a lot about vitamin C. And I believe that everyone should have a vitamin C in their routine. Use your vitamin C serum. It's great for dark spots is great for being an antioxidant that stabilizes your molecules um, it's one of those ingredients that you need to have the good thing about grapefruit peel oil is that it is rich in vitamin c so not only are you getting it from your serum that you should be using every day you're actually getting it from your cleanser and this is what's important is because you know i see a lot of times people like the cleanser um and dermatologists have actually been recommending it too. And it's uh, the Cetaphil or, um, I'll just go after that one, Cetaphil. Well, you don't have other things in there that are doing, doing anything. You want cleansers that have ingredients that are active and helping you in other, other aspects of your skincare. Hey, um, Mer mercy mercy me welcome to the three waxing show welcome um sovereignty beauty welcome to the three waxing show so it's important to when you have a cleanser you don't want it to just cleanse your skin you want it to have all these other benefits and i think that's i was thinking about that over the weekend is how do i explain why you need you know to not use cetaphil or all the ones that are just plain cleansers 
because you can find cleansers that have active ingredients that are good for sensitive skin. This is a really good one for sensitive skin. Hey, Johnny, welcome to the 3B Waxing Show. So this, you know, this one or there's other ones that are good for sensitive skin that have active ingredients. So I did want to say that. Vitamin C. Another thing vitamin C does is, um, tell me, yes, uh, it stabilizes the molecules. We've talked about this before. Um, when we have unstable molecules in our skin, that's when we start looking old, that's when we get dark spots, that's when um, our skin just looks dull. When you stabilize the molecules, that starts improving your skin and the way to stabilize molecules is to have antioxidants. And vitamin C is a big antiox antioxidant. So another thing grapefruit pill oil does is it brightens the skin. So if you are working on dark spots, which I get a lot of DMs about, uh, having a vitamin C is important. Using uh, a spot treatment pigment gel, I have this sample one right here from PCA. But also having a cleanser with the ingredients that do that. So that way you're attacking it multiple ways. And if you are doing your routine twice a day and you're doing your cleanser four, four times a day, because remember, we want to double cleanse, then you're attacking your dark spots a lot because you want to do things in minimal, con I don't know how to say it correctly, but consistently, very little consistently. That's basically what I'm saying, trying to say. Instead of doing like major things all the time at once, Doing things consistently is going to give you the best results. And then if you pair that up with getting chemical peels or getting facials that are dealing with dark spots or um, whatever you're trying to deal with, then you're attacking the problems in your skin properly. The last one about the grapefruit peel oil is that it's an antiseptic. Uh, this is, uh, it's going to prevent the growth of disease-causing uh, microorganisms. So keeps it uh, from the bacteria, those kind of things. That's what it helps with. So you want ante antiseptics in your products as well. So it's good for bacteria. So if you want to screenshot it and flip it, I'll put it up to, um, I'll put it up to the screen. And then we are open for questions. I think that's it. Hey author, welcome to the Boxing Show. So if you need to screenshot it and flip it, it's rich in vitamin C, brightens the skin, and an antiseptic. This is what the bottle looks like. I know we talked about it earlier. And the price of this cleanser is $26.50. That's about the right price probably 30 between like $25 and um, $35 is about the amount you want to pay for a cleanser with active ingredients. This looks like a, like a picture. It's really zooming in nicely. Or it's focusing without me having to do much. <laughs> Anyways. So any questions? I'm going to I'm gonna delete this. If everyone got it. Whoever's on. Got it. Grapefruit peel oil. So there you go. Um, there's a lot of things I like about this cleanser, but, um, one thing I do want to get across is that find active ingredients in your cleansers. Don't just think like, oh, my cleanser is just to cleanse my face and then I'll put the products on that matter. No, if you can have quality stuff in your cleansers, you are helping your other stuff work better. Um, and the whole goal is to have every product that touches your face mean something 
and um, be important. And so that's what, that's what, that's the goal here. That is the goal. So uh, thank you for joining. I oh my offer. If you found this information useful, I do have the free guide. It's the perfect skincare guide. It talks about the different skin types there are and then tips to improve or um, products to look for for those different skin types. Another thing is I am doing skin improvement calls. I actually am doing that today, so I have to get off. But um, yeah, I really hope that this is valuable for you and uh, you start really improving your skin with these tips. So. Uh, you said I need to get some stuff for the wife. She has dark spots. I told her she needs a scrub from you. Yes. Um, so dark spots for sure. Uh, if she wants to do, if she likes a face scrub, then, and she doesn't want to do the pads, then I would say she could do the skin script, uh, retinol scrub. And then she, she makes sure she wears sunscreen. Um, that's gonna help a lot. And then a cleanser, this is a good one for dark spots. Doing a cleanser, the retinol scrub. Uh, yeah, and that'll help her with her um, dark spots. Yeah, good thing you said, I'll get a pic and send it for you. She doesn't let me take <laughs> Well, that's the goal. That is really the goal is for, to help people feel confident without makeup when i first started uh 3b waxing that was one of my big goals is like um get people to feel confident without makeup and it was it was very emotional for me and my clients when they were like feeling better about not wearing makeup because it just it felt so great so i will need one-on-one because i need help with this face well i am happy to help you um yeah, I'm happy to help. Literally, I've be I've had clients where they've only seen me for waxing and I've done a consultation with them about their skincare and like, okay, you need to do this and this. You need to move this around and start using this instead. You need to find something with this, this, and this. Um, obviously, I love it if you get my products, but there have been times where I've told people like, okay, this is why this is happening and you need to do this and this and they have changed their skin within weeks. So um, I'm happy to help you and um, look forward to talking with you. So you guys have a good rest of your day. I'm about to go ship out the last thing of pads and then uh, do some calls. So you guys take care.